Hello friends, in this video I am going to show you how you can get the very best quality with a very low file size. Uh, these settings apply only for video tutorials because you do not need a very good frame rate. You cannot use these settings for your video like movies and music videos because any music video or movie need a good frame rate like uh, 60 frames per second 50 frames per second so in this in these settings we are lowering the frame rate and it doesn't matter in our video tutorials like programming tutorials or my this current video tutorial okay so before uh, moving further let's start with the recording option uh, they, my recording options are very default I haven't made any changes in it and the screen resolution matters a very lot it is recommended to record uh, videos in square resolution for a lower size to lower your screen resolution right click on your windows desktop screen resolution and lower it my current my normal resolution is this which is a wide screen I have made it a square resolution in your computer in your desktop you can get up to 800 by 600 and which is a recommended resolution for web video if you can record a video in 800 by 600 it is a very good resolu resolution for your tutorials now click ok after that just make sure you do not use any background <coughs> music because uh, it simply increase your audio size and it means the video size is going to affect and try to uh, not use any much transitions like uh, this uh, like my this like uh, I am switching to this and uh, it is flying from here to here just try to resist that and do not make any uh, do not use any transparency in your recording time ok so you have recorded your audio video whatever now it is going to open in Camtasia so let's see what options we get Uh, let's uh, I have forgot to show the result I have uh, with these settings which I am going to show you I have recorded my uh, video and you can see the file size is around 13 MB and you will amaze with the time video time it is around 15 minutes you so it is a very good compression and you can see the quality is much much better than any other settings you will get on the net you can see it is a very good setting and this video is uploaded in my channel so you can check the video quality too you can see it is 720p and it has only 13 MB in file size and 15 minutes of time ok so we have opened our project and make sure you always uh, use your project in default recording dimensions if you are altering lowering or hiring the resolution of the video it will greatly affect your video output so always keep the recording dimension and click ok now do not use much zoom and pan just try to resist with zoom and pan and do not use much transitions do not use any effects uh, try to use these flat colors and try to use these transparent uh, text which do not have any colors do not use these animations it will increase your 
video file size okay uh, so uh, I think I have told you about do not use any transitions if you are using a transitions keep the transition times very low like 0 0.25 seconds uh, video uh, do not make changes m much changes in vi visual properties okay so these are the tips and the main setting coming here click on that produce and share and we are going to ma make a new preset go to add edit preset now I am choosing my preset you can choose any mp4 for right now because you will not have these this preset mp4 and click new name it any put and have a file format for mp4 click next and if you want HTML out output you can keep ticket but I don't need any HTML out sorry HTML output now go to size if you have HTML output you will have this option so keep tick auto calculate embed dimension now switch to video setting this is the main part uh, you can keep the frame rate 6, 7 or 10 but for me the 10 is very good uh, if if you are keeping the frame rate 5 your cursor will not move is smoothly and if you are keeping the frame rate 7 or 6 there will be not a uh, much difference file size difference 6 to 10 so better you keep it 10 and this is very important key frame every this should be 10 if you keep it 1 it will uh, I think trip three, make 3 times file size so keep it 10 and other things should be same baseline uh, you can also use the main if you want but baseline is ok and quality should be 50% do not uh, alter this quality it will surely uh, disturb your quality even you increase it it will not give a good result and audio encode, encode a audio 48 you can use lower um, but 40 is okay, 48 is ok uh, you can use up to 28 not less than and other option is not there now click next you can include watermark if you want and click finish now you have your preset click close and whenever you want to have an output so click on that and choose your tool and it will render it so uh, my current video will be in same uh, settings so I will post my file size so make sure you uh, you will check my this video description you can compare the uh, video time with the file size and the video quality too so I hope uh, it give a much better uh, file compression and file size which are available on the net there are so many uh, settings available on the net but I don't think they will give a good result than this so I, re I will wait for your response whether it is good or not so this is it and thanks for watching my video and if you have any request and you are you like my videos you can uh, subscribe my channel and share my videos have a good day